Bravo. I knew you'd figure it out eventually. Zia. No. You could never resist the big payout. What can I say? I'm a greedy man. That's why you don't have any friends. You're selfish. She has you there. Ouch. Tässä on luola jossain lähellä. Se selittäisikin itse asiassa ton markkerin sijaini. Well, that is a kind of reasonable. <laughs> Tridentin kootut lausahdukset. Someone got to them first. And destroyed Ashland's missing parts. What the hell did they? this? And the toy belly of Yantos. That's the poison, he said. I can't hear it. I'm a liar. Raivoa per tonni luku oli aika hyvä tolla. Tota, on huoneja ja hyviä uutisia. Dead. A fiend got them. And the turbine parts? Destroyed. Nothing left but scrap. I'll take satisfaction knowing my yard drive isn't being used by a bloody scav. Thanks, Pathfinder. Stay safe. Yeah, sure. Ryder. Perfect timing. You saved me the trouble of looking for you. Something wrong? Have there been more murders? Nothing so morbid. This is actually a personal favor. A business rival, Zia Cordier, lifted cargo I was moving for a client. You want my help getting it back? We worked so well together on the row car job, I thought you'd be willing. How'd this rival of yours get hold of your cargo? Her usual tactics. Got my middleman drunk, then stole his ship. 
Sounds like you know from experience. Please, I keep to a three drink maximum when I'm on a job. <laughs> what did she steal? No idea. Client paid extra for privacy. Considering my fees, it must be valuable. You didn't check? Honors got a price. And the client paid it. We cut the profits 50 50. <laughs> 60-40. Final offer. Deal. When she stops in Kadara, Zia drinks at Krala's song. We'll start there. See if Umi heard anything that could help us. You look like you're waiting for someone. That's my line. <sighs> You want a drink or a room? <laughs> Information, actually. <laughs> That'll cost you more than a round of drinks. My friend's good for it. You still owe me for the last time. Fine, fine. It was just a joke. I've got a bottle of Elasa I'm willing to part with. <sighs> what do you want to know? Zia Cordier. She been around recently? You mean your ex? Yeah, she was here. You never mentioned Zaya was your girlfriend. Uh, she's not. We drink together sometimes. I drink with a lot of people. Anyway, she was here? Yeah, met with a Solarian. Shifty guy I'd never seen before. Maybe it was the charlatan. Anything's possible. You overhear their conversation? They were planning to meet someone at Spirit's Ledge. Thanks, Umi. Whatever. You didn't hear it from me. If you check the meeting spot, I'll follow the collective lead. Doubt Zia was meeting the charlatan, but you never know. <laughs> I'll call you when I get there. Thanks, Ryder. Joo, joo, peli. Ymmärrän kyllä, että tuttu on yksi, yksi <laughs> romanssipahdollisuus. Itse asiassa pelasin niin kuin, ää, tuolla... Sara Raiderilla ensimmäisen pelin, niin sit silloin itse asiassa pääty, pääty suhteeseen ton kanssa. Mikä on niin seidi. Things seem tense between the outcasts and the collective. They're a bunch of hypocritical upstarts who hide their dirty tactics behind good business. Mm -hmm. See? There's that tension. Sloan will make quick work of them. Why hasn't she done so already? Good point. Tip. It's not for me to question her methods. Kader is ours. Nothing's gonna change that. That's all for now. See you around, Pathfinder. You okay? What? Oh, yeah, of course. Maybe you should freak out more quietly then, so you don't draw attention to yourself. Shit, is like that obvious? Mm -hmm. Uh, yeah. What's going on? I joined the outcasts a few weeks ago. Kaidas tasked me with collecting protection fees. Thought it'd be easy. But we talked to so many people. I got the names mixed up and banished someone who paid their fee. Oops. They didn't protest it? Of course, she did. But they all do. We don't really listen. What are the chances she's still alive? I don't know. Slim. The Badlands are... bad. I thought about looking for her, but I can't risk Kytus finding out I screwed up. I need this job to feed my little brother. Our mom's still in cryo on the Nexus. He's got no one else. I'll look for her. Just tell me her name and any clues about where she might be. Remy Tamayo. She would have gone to the slums for processing. After that, no idea. Uh, the warden might know. Everyone who's banished to the Badlands goes through him. I'm looking for a Remy Tamayo. Any idea where I might find her? Hmm, Tamayo, Tamayo. Oh, yeah. <laughs> she's the one who kept insisting she's innocent. She is innocent. The outcast collecting the fees made a mistake. Remy paid up. Well, shit. That's never happened before. <laughs> Water must be. As far as you know. Don't get smart, Pathfinder. Last time I saw your girl, 
She was talking with Johan and his crew. Nasty bunch. I'll send you the nav point to their last known location. Prepare for a fight. Have a moment, Pat. You've handled your fair share of cat. <laughs> Hard to get far in Andromeda without running into them. Yes, and? When Sloan took over, she slaughtered the cat who were here. There were mass executions, public. So people would know that Kadara was cat free. But there have been rumors of stragglers in the Badlands. If the tales are true, they need to go. If there are cat out there, send your own crew to deal with them. Listen, this is how it is. Everyone knows Sloan destroyed the cat presence here. Anything that hints otherwise, weakness. Hmm. But you, you're independent. Where you go, what you do, nothing to do with Sloan. I'll think about checking out the Badlands. Excellent. <laughs> Reyes, I found a data pad with what looks like a nav point. Must be where Zia's hiding the cargo. Probably left that behind for the buyer. Whatever happened to just going to a store? Sloan takes a cut from all official sales in Kadara. Gotta get creative if you want to go around that. Did you find anything on your end? The Salarian is a fence. No direct connection to the Collective. My guess is Zia met him to find potential buyers. Let's follow up on those coordinates. I'll meet you there. No gun, no credits. I'm not looking for trouble. Wait. You don't look like one of them. You're not here to kill me, are you? I don't want trouble either. I'm from the Nexus. I figured, but you can never be too careful. Outcast, collective, they'll all shoot you for the lint in your pocket. Which team are you batting for? Outcasts or collective? Neither. I wasn't even going to join the Nexus Rebellion until my brother convinced me. He died in the uprising. By the time I had a change of heart, it was too late. Now I try to keep my head down and not take sides. Best way to stay alive, in my opinion. Just how dangerous is the water anyway? Very. The Angara have a filtration system that takes out the lethal stuff. Still tastes like a Krogan's undersuit. Smells too. Appetizing. That's Kadara for you. What doesn't kill you makes you wish it did. You get a lot of cat out here? Not many. Sloan saw to that when we first arrived. I've heard rumblings, though. People going missing, tech breaking down. Makes me wonder if she really got all of them. Stay safe out here. Yeah, safe. Eli se on tuossa viereisessä paikassa.
Petra. Find Remy. Kesti ruokamyrkytys. Are you all right? They were going to eat me. I know. They brought a group of us here from the slums. Said we'd be safe. I'm the only one left. You survived. That's what matters. I'm not even supposed to be out here. I paid my protection fee. I know. The outcast who wrongly kicked you out of Kadara port. He sent me. Are they going to let me back in? At the very least. Grayson, I found Remy. We need a pickup. Thank God. I'll send a shuttle right away. Thank you so much. Thank you. buyer could be inside. It's empty. What if this was all just some elaborate trick to get you here? Huh. You mean... There was never any cargo. Bravo. I knew you'd figure it out eventually. Zia. Oh. You could never resist the big payout. What can I say? I'm a greedy man. That's why you don't have any friends. You're selfish. She has you there. Ouch. You must be losing your touch, Reyes. I remember you being such a smooth talker, right up until you dumped me. Don't tell me that's what this is all about. Of course not. You've been taking all the good jobs in Kadara. It's gotten more than my attention. So what? The local smuggling union got together and decided to take me down? Something like that. Ah, oh, shit. Move in.
tomut jaloista planeetan. What's up, Ryder? Why an emergency meeting? I didn't call it. I did. Got some disturbing news while we were on Kadara. There's some tension at the Krogan colony on Eladin. It's bad. Tension among Krogan? You don't say. <laughs> I wouldn't waste your time with this if it wasn't important. We need to go. I agree. Nakmor Morda made herself overlord of the colony. It's weird. No. Our priority is the Archon. We have to remain focused on his next move. Jal's right. We won't make any rash decisions. Drax just brought a problem to the team. Let's dial down the emotions so we can be clear-headed. Well, as long as we're pitching stuff, I overheard outlaws on Kadara talking about activity in the Ramav system. No, that's the system where the Turian Golden World was supposed to be. Ramav? There aren't any viable planets there. Only an asteroid field with mining ventures run by criminals. I hear Elodin's pretty rough too. Roving scavengers with nothing to lose. Crap. No one fights harder than people with nothing to lose. But now that we have the transponder, we're so close to finding the location of Archon's ship. Our goal is to create our home here. You never know how something might fit in. Anyway, get Kalo the nav points for both Elodin and that potential Turian Golden World. We want all our options ready to go. Hey, I didn't say dismissed or meeting adjourned or anything. Meeting adjourned, as you were. Kadara port's pretty grisly, huh? Probably get into all sorts of trouble there. And now we're going after the Archon's ship? Sure that's a good idea. In the absence of any others, it's an excellent one. Guess I can't argue with that. Anything else to go over? Is there more about Kalinda you want to share? Back home, she was upper crust. An ambassador. Respected, living the high life, but miserable. Not built for royalty, she said. With her position, the initiative sought her out as a first contact specialist. First wave out of stasis. Kalinda was the one who got me thought out early. I'm so grateful for that. But things went south soon. She hurt me. Pretty badly. What happened? Oh, let's not drum up that soft story. It's all water under the bridge. Thanks for chatting. We'll talk again later. You know it. Hey, Jal. <laughs> Didn't mean to scare you. What? Uh, I'm, I'm not scared. Uh-huh. Uh, one second. What's going on in here? You look busy. If I'm busy, my mind is occupied with whatever I'm working on, uh, rather than worrying. Whatever gets you through. Uh, I'd like your advice on something. I'm making gifts for everyone. I have a list. Gifts? Hmm. Do Turians like poetry? For Vetra, I'm writing a poem and engraving it on... Uh, well, uh, I'm not sure yet. Who doesn't like a personalized poem? Ah, great. <laughs> Maybe I could just recite it for her. Uh, make sure I'm there for that. Uh, Liam seems to like my Rothjin. I might sew him one. He does. Do Krogan like knives? I could craft a ceremonial Angaran dagger for Drac. Who wouldn't want that? It's mainly decorative. Would you like one? Jal, this is a lot of work. What's really going on? Yo. I'm sure that I seem confident and skilled to you, but I'm not. Or I don't feel like I am. I feel like that a lot. <laughs> Good to know. Yes, thanks for sharing that. 
Just be yourself. My family is well known. Our lineage is respected. And many of my kin have achieved great things. I've never been one of them. So many older siblings and cousins who succeeded at everything. I stopped trying to keep up. Right. Thanks for listening. You're not in anyone's shadow here. I believe in you. Gil, here's that cat transponder. The spy used it to get his orders. What do we need from it? The location it points to should give us a fix on the Archon's ship. <sighs> right. It's not like there's much riding on this. Just our best chance to find Meridian. <laughs> Glyke keep. Pressure. I like that. Mm. Luckily, no matter where you go in the universe, physics still applies. Only so many ways of communicating across space. There. Give it a shot. Did you connect the... <laughs> Shit, turn it off. Careful. That is a direct line to people who want to murder everyone on this ship. <laughs> <laughs> there, there, like, I have the that. coordinates. The signal points to the Tafino system. We sure we want to do this? I know we're still getting our feet wet, but I don't see another choice. <laughs> I knew running off to Andromeda would be dangerous, but shit. This is dangerous. Only if we die. Hmm. We got it, Ryder. You patched up the Asari flight recorder? Some old access codes, a little data recovery from Sam. We have the Asari Ark's last heading. Nav points are set. We can head there whenever you're ready. Remember the survey ship? This might not be pretty. Are you... Handling tough stuff is my job. We need the Asari and Sarissa more than ever. I trust you to find them before the Ket do. Hey, Ryder. Got an encrypted message from Sid. She has news and wanted to talk to us both. Connecting the call now. Finally! I've been waiting for hours! So you want to tell us what this is all about? I was listening to outpost updates and caught a message about settlers going missing. That doesn't sound good. Yeah, because it's not. They were kidnapped. I dug around, and I think I know where they've been taken. A cave on a moon in the Ramav system. Originally an Angaran mine, I think, but they abandoned it. I don't believe the planet you're talking about is a moon. Stuff. Whatever. What did I tell you about getting involved? I couldn't just do nothing. How do we know your intel's even reliable? It's reliable. I trust your sister. And there's no sense in wasting time. See? That's a pathfinder. <laughs> Sid, just give us everything you have on this. Already done. Could I come along? I want to help. <sighs> you know the answer to that. Right, of course. Stay away from bad people, guns, bombs, Krogan beer. You did good. I just want you to be safe, okay? Yeah, yeah. Pathfinder, sorry if things got strange last time we talked. Mm -hmm. You're the first person I told about all that. It um felt really good. I know it was really personal. Thank you for trusting me with it. You say that like I was making logical choices. Thanks for getting it. Anyway, made me think we should do more just out and about. Off ship, like the market on Aya. I've got some contacts and some things I'd like your eyes on. But mostly, it's a day out. Something familiar. Turns out I need that. Going through the readouts from the cat facility. I've never seen such advanced genetic technology. Frankly, it's light years ahead of our capabilities. How do you think the crew is holding up? I'm happy to share what I can without violating patient confidentiality. Anyone in particular? I sort them in their files and my brain by species. How do you think the human crew members are handling things? There's a lot of them. 
How's Cora doing? Cora's commando training makes her think Asari have all the answers. Just because we live longer doesn't mean we can't screw up. It just means we have more time to make mistakes. How's Liam? A handful. Every time I patch him up, he breaks something new. Hmm. Liam's we can't lose attitude is commendable. But I worry how he'll react when something does go wrong. I'd like to check in on the non-human crew. Ask away. Tell me about Vetra. Vetra's used to having someone depend on her. I think that's why she's so resourceful and likes providing for other people. That being said, I think she could use a little me time. Is Drac good? That old bastard's always good. I've never met anyone who can be so stubborn and so appreciative. Could you look out for him, Ryder? Don't worry, Lexi. I'll keep an eye on him. Thank you. And maybe don't mention I asked. <laughs> okay. Is up. Joel doing okay? He's adjusting. The rest of us have at least some understanding of each other's cultures. Mm. But to Jal, we're all outsiders. It's a lot to take in. I'd say he's doing pretty well. Is PB all right? She's avoiding me. Probably thinks I'll poke her with a needle if she gets too close. To be fair, you're always giving me shots. Not in the hallway. <laughs> Thanks for the insight. Not being a lot more nasty. Ryder, how's my favorite Pathfinder? Just enjoying another day of what Helios has to offer. Why? Thought we could grab a drink. Sloan's holding a get-together for the locals. I managed to snag an invite. Care to be my plus one? Sloan doesn't seem like the party type. She sees these events as a necessary evil to keep the people happy. I'd never say no to free drinks. Especially from Sloan's reserve. I'll meet you outside Outcast HQ. Oh, thank God. Didn't think anyone would stop. I need you to deliver a message. Please. First, tell me why they've got you locked up. Uh, I may have had too much to drink. <laughs> and urinated on one of the guards. No may have about it. My boots still smell of piss. <laughs> I've always been a bad drunk. All right. What's the message? My girlfriend, Sila, works at Tartarus. Most beautiful Asari you've ever seen. Skin like the ocean, eyes like... Jim, the message? Right. Tell Sila I've run into a, a complication. But I'll have the credits to pay Sloan's protection fee soon. Ask her to wait for me. Oh, and leave out the part where I'm in jail. Thanks. Sila, I've got a message from Jim, your boyfriend. Got it. Don't tell me he really thinks I'm his girlfriend. Hopeful thinking on his part? More than helpful. Delusional. Go on then. What's the message? He said he'll have enough credits to pay Sloan's protection fees soon. And, uh, to wait for him. You tell Jim thanks, but I'm happy at Tatars. I don't need rescuing, especially from a pup like him. No, I told Jim I'd deliver the message, and I have. You got more to say? Do it yourself. All right. Sheesh. Did you find Sila? Was she worried? No, because she's not your girlfriend. Shit. I hope she changed her mind. Focus on yourself, Jim. Sila's happy where she is. <sighs> Damn it. Että tuommoista saa kokemuspisteitä. Hold up. This is a private event. Name's Ryder. Human Pathfinder? I'm kind of a big deal. <laughs> There's no Ryder on the list. He's with me. Reyes Vidal. Go on in. Reyes Vidal, I was beginning to think you wouldn't show. Remember what I said about fashionably late? Shh, 
Introduce me to your companion. Pathfinder, meet Kima Dorgan, the Angaran representative to Sloan and uh, a friend. I didn't think Reyes had friends, only contacts and colleagues. Yes. Oh, I'm those as well. Who do you think secured him an invitation to this event? Sorry to cut this short, but I need to take care of something. Mm -hmm. Abandoning me already? It won't take long. There are important players here tonight. You should mingle and make a good impression. You're gonna be playing catch up on all the fun. I work best one step behind. Promise. Huh. And there he goes. Any idea what he's up to? It's better not to worry about what Reyes does. Enjoy the party. Oh, you've seen better. What an unexpected surprise. Sloan, what gives? I thought we were friends. I'm glad we cleared up that misunderstanding. Shots later? No. Free food and beer are just so hard to come by in Helios. Uh -huh. Just keep a low profile. Sloan's already gonna give me hell. Good to see you again, Pathfinder. What's it mean to be an Angaran representative to Sloan? Sloan relies on me to provide an Angaran perspective. Does she listen to you? Only in extreme cases. She makes a show of being pro-Angaran, but her priority is the outcasts. She throws these parties to mollify my people. It won't work forever. How did you meet Reyes? The only way anyone meets Reyes Vidal. Through business. His skills are very valuable in Kadara Port. Are you part of the Resistance? No. Ephra and I share information, but Kadara's problems come first. If war breaks out between the Collective and the Outcasts, it will be my people who suffer. I hope these pirates haven't given you a bad view of my people. <laughs> Don't worry, Ryder. I judge individuals, not groups. You, for example, I like. Not sure about who you work for, but I've learned to keep my options open. You never know who might end up in charge. Exactly. Have you seen Reyes? No, but I'm sure he'll be back soon. Nice talking to you, Kima. Likewise, Pathfinder. Reyes, where are you? No answer, but I believe he headed to one of the side rooms when we arrived, Pathfinder. Let's see what he's up to. Damn it. Why can't the serial numbers be in the same spot? Take the night off. Come out for a drink. Should have known you were up to something. Ryder, it's not what it looks like. Uh -huh. So you didn't use me as a distraction to go through Sloane's stuff? <laughs> okay, yes. But it's for both our benefit. I You've promise. been making a lot of promises. Shit, someone's coming. We need a distraction. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> My friend had a bit too much to drink. <sighs> hey, it worked. <laughs> <laughs> Next time, I come up with the plan. Finally, here it is. <clears throat> That's what this was all about? Whiskey? The only bottle of Mount Milgram in Andromeda. Triple distilled and 645 years old. This isn't whiskey. It's treasure. Mm -hmm. I hope you're planning on sharing. <laughs> huh. We'll see. Let's get out of here. Gorgeous, I sometimes forget. 
Is Andromeda everything you hoped it would be? Every day is an adventure. Even my nights off are interesting. <laughs> what about you? Why did you come here, Reyes? To be someone. That sounded surprisingly genuine, coming from you. I'm always genuine, Ryder. In my own way. Huh. 